The tale of zero, symbols, frequencies, and the quest for reality. Once upon a time, in a world not unlike our own, there lived a curious soul named Zero. Zero was no ordinary individual, they were a seeker of truths, a weaver of dreams, and a silent architect of their own reality. This is the story of how Zero discovered the hidden power of symbols, messages, and frequencies, and how they used this knowledge to transform their life and the world around them. Chapter 1 The Awakening Zero's journey began in the quiet corner of a bustling city, where the hum of life was punctuated by the silent whispers of symbols. From the billboards, casting their glow to the t-shirt speaking silent words of wisdom, Zero felt the pull of something deeper, a language beyond words that spoke directly to the soul. Chapter 2 The Revelation It was a simple message on a passerby's t-shirt that sparked the epiphany, Believe in Yourself. The words, simple yet profound, struck a chord within Zero. They realized that these symbols and messages were not mere decorations, but powerful tools that shaped the fabric of their reality. Chapter 3, The Quest Zero embarked on a quest to understand this hidden language. They delved into the study of semiotics, the science of signs, and symbols. They learned how every symbol was a key to unlocking a part of the human psyche, a tool that could be used to program the mind towards empowerment or despair. Chapter 4, The Experiment With newfound knowledge, Zero began to experiment. They adorned their own clothing with symbols of strength and affirmations of hope. They noticed a shift within themselves, a growing confidence and clarity of purpose. But Zero yearned for more, they wanted to understand how these symbols could change not just the self but the very world they inhabited. Chapter 5, The Frequency, Zero's research led them to the esoteric realms of quantum physics and the study of frequencies. They learned that everything in the universe vibrated at a certain frequency and that these vibrations could be harmonized or disrupted by other frequencies. Zero wondered, could the right frequency harmonize the chaos of their world? Chapter 6, The Synergy, Zero began to combine symbols with frequencies, wearing a pendant that resonated with the frequency of peace while meditating on symbols of harmony. The effect was profound. Zero felt a deeper connection to the world, a sense of unity with the surrounding chaos. Chapter 7, The Transformation, As Zero walked through the city, their presence became a beacon of change. People felt calmer around them, more at peace. The symbols Zero wore and the frequency they emanated worked subliminally, touching the lives of others in ways unseen but deeply felt. Chapter 8, The Spread, Word of Zero's Transformation Spread Others began to adopt their practices, wearing symbols of positivity and tuning into harmonious frequencies. The city began to transform, as if the very concrete and steel were responding to this new, silent language. Chapter 9, The Community Zero formed a community, a group of like-minded individuals who understood the power of symbols and frequencies. They shared their knowledge, teaching others how to shape their realities, how to weave the fabric of their lives with intention and purpose. Chapter 10, The Ripple Effect The changes that began in a small corner of the city rippled outward, touching lives far beyond its borders. Zero's message, once confined to a simple t-shirt, became a global symphony of transformation. Epilogue, the legacy of Zero, Zero's legacy was not in the symbols themselves, but in the awakening they brought about. They showed the world that reality was not fixed, not immutable, but a canvas awaiting the brushstrokes of our intentions. Through symbols and frequencies, Zero taught us that we are all artists of our own lives, capable of painting a world of harmony, peace, and boundless possibility. And so, the tale of Zero is not just a story but a testament to the power within us all, the power to shape our reality, to transform our world, and to leave a legacy of change that echoes through the ages. Quantum Unraveling, 15 Steps to Liberate Yourself from External Symbolic Programming in a Reality Where Symbols and Logos Are Not Just Designs But Powerful Tools That Can Influence Our Subconscious, It's Essential to Develop a Quantum Understanding a deeper awareness that transcends the surface-level impact of these symbols. Here are 15 steps to help you navigate and neutralize their subtle programming effects. Step 1. Symbolic Literacy Learn the Language of Symbols 
understand the historical and cultural significance of common symbols and logos to grasp their subconscious impact. Step 2. Intentional Symbolism Surround yourself with symbols and logos that align with your values and aspirations. This conscious choice counters the unwanted programming from external sources. Step 3. Media Detox Regularly take breaks from media consumption to give your mind space from the constant barrage of symbolic influences. Step 4. Subliminal Awareness Educate yourself about subliminal messages in advertising and media. Being aware of these tactics diminishes their power over you. Step 5. Quantum Perspective Adopt a quantum perspective by recognizing that your observation and attention give power to symbols. Choose where to direct this energy wisely. Step 6. Mindful Affirmations Use affirmations to reinforce your agency. Affirmations are your personal symbols of power, encoded with your intentions and free from external influence. Step 7. Symbolic Cleansing Perform regular, symbolic cleanses where you evaluate and possibly discard items that carry logos or symbols that no longer serve your highest good. Step 8. Creative Visualization and Harness the power of visualization to mentally redesign symbols that you cannot avoid. Imagine them as neutral or even positive to reduce their unwanted influence. Step 9. Energetic Shielding and practice energetic shielding techniques, such as visualizing a protective barrier around you, to guard against the pervasive energy of external symbols. Step 10. Vibrational Alignment Align yourself with high-frequency living, which naturally diminishes the lower vibrational impact of manipulative symbols and logos. Step 11. Symbolic Deconstruction When confronted with a symbol, mentally deconstruct it into basic shapes and colors. This practice can help strip away its programmed power. Step 12. Quantum Questioning Ask yourself quantum questions like, what reality am I reinforcing by buying into this symbol? This helps you to make choices that resonate with your desired reality. Step 13. Conscious Community Engagement Engage with communities that understand and discuss the impact of symbols. Shared knowledge and support can amplify your ability to resist external programming, Step 14. Symbolic Reclamation Reclaim symbols that have been co-opted. Infuse them with your personal meaning, effectively rewriting their influence in your life. Step 15. Quantum Creation Finally, step into the role of a quantum creator. Design your own symbols and logos that encapsulate your essence and intentions, anchoring you in your personal power and reality. By integrating these steps into your life, you create a quantum field of awareness that acts as a buffer against the subtle influences of symbols and logos. This is not just a mental exercise, but a vibrational shift that empowers you to navigate the symbolic landscape with autonomy and intention. Remember, in the quantum realm, your focused intention is the key to shaping the reality you experience. Thanks for watching, please like this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more free videos. Check out researchforum.online for research papers today.